This is Bolt.DIY running locally on my computer and I'm using QWQ32B. This is a reasoning model recently released by Alibaba and QWQ32B is direct competitor of DeepSeek R1. Here's a very detailed comparison of benchmarks between QWQ32B and DeepSeek R1. OpenAI O1 Mini, DeepSeek R1 distilled with Llama 70B and DeepSeek R1 distilled with Quen 32p. You can see QWQ in red beating all of these different models in all of these different benchmarks. There's this very detailed blog about QWQ 32p. If you're interested, you can read it. I will leave a link in description. You can try this model on chat.qn.ai absolutely for free. But in this video, our goal is to use this QWQ 32p model for coding using bold.dy. If you're interested to run this model locally, you can do that using Olama. You can just go to olama.com and then you can download Olama locally on your computer. You can find this QWQ model in here the total download size is 20 gb so make sure that you have enough space on your computer and also make sure that you have a good gpu to make sure that this model runs fast on your computer but in this video we'll use this model through open router we can use this model through open router api key absolutely for free you can just go to openrouter.ai and then inside this search bar just enter qwq and you can find this qwq 32p and we can use it absolutely for free from here just click on this api key and then click on this create api key button and it will give you this api key you can use this api key inside bold.dy now i have already downloaded bold.dy on my computer i have covered the installation of bold.dy in several videos to download bold.dy locally on your computer you can simply just go to this url which is bold.dy and then after that it will open this github repository in here you can simply just clone this github repository i will leave a link in description for a detailed installation guide i have covered the installation steps several times on my videos but i'll just quickly explain it here first thing that you need to do simply just create an empty folder and after that just open that folder inside terminal then simply just write this command git clone and then provide that url then press enter and it will download that locally on your computer after that you need to run these three commands inside your downloaded directory so once bold.dy will be downloaded on your computer you can simply just open that downloaded directory open that inside your terminal and then you can just run these three commands one by one this is how it will look like once you run your first command after that just run the second command which is pnpm install and then it will take a couple of minutes to install all of these uh, libraries after that just run this pnpm run dev and then it will give you this localhost url simply just open this localhost url inside your chrome browser it is also recommended to use chrome canary browser you can download this browser from google chrome once you have opened this url it will just open this page for you sometimes it will not show you this api keys section in here so all you have to do you'll simply just have to click on this reload button and then you can simply just access all of these different api keys options in here after that you can simply just go to settings of this bolt.diy and then you can simply just go to your local providers and from local providers let's suppose if you're using lm studio or maybe if you're using this qwq model through olama so make sure that you have enabled this options from here but because we are going to use through open router so just select this open router option from here after that from here inside search model just look for qwq and then from here just look for the free version of qwq which is this one qwq 32b free version so just make sure that you have selected that and then after that you can you now you are good to go you can just give your command and create anything that you want i'll just give it a command create a landing page for my habit tracker app in next.js then simply just press on enter and now it will start writing code now it is just creating our empty next.js project and setting up all of the code files there was an error i'll just click on fix error and now it is just fixing that error okay this is what it has created this is very ugly looking landing page but yeah i mean this was the first prompt you can just now ask it to like enhance the design but yeah that's not the main goal here our main focus was to use to test Quen QWQ 32B. Maybe you can try using with Olama as well, or maybe you can try with Klein. I'll create a separate video that how you can use QWQ with Klein and I'll see the results. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I see you next video. Bye bye.